I'm in a whip, so I gotta zoom. They tryna talk, they not in a room. I've been so real, I'm dead to the tomb. They in a way, they gotta move. I got a gas, they want in a fumes. I'm told on my bag, it's something new. Bring it down, you gotta choose. I'm taking my smile, I'm doing food. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Customer take one of our gift cards that's not even activated. They see them on there and they think they're gonna maybe get to use them. I don't know. Or they're just taking it as a business card, thinking it's a business card because it has their information on it. So I always mark them so I know that they're that they're not valid. Yeah. But <laughs> what do you do? Put another one up there. I was ecstasy. Everyone got sick. Why? But it was alright. Huh? Why everybody just sick? We had a mole going around. You got everybody sick. I'm not gonna name names. <laughs> what happened? Like sick wise. I don't know bro. They got all sick. He was one of the people who got sick, so you can ask him. Nah, 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 nah. I was Tyler. I was Tyler. Tyler was sick? Tyler was sick, man. I don't... What happened? Man. What, what kind of, like, stomach or something? Dude, so... He gets, uh... He gets, like, homesick, you know? Yeah. And, uh... I don't know, man. He had a horrible cough. He had, like, sore throat. He got everybody sick. He got me sick. He got James sick. He got Robert sick. He got David sick. Kevin feels a little sick too right now. So, I don't know. They saying me, but I don't believe it. <laughs> I don't believe it. It's tacky when there's tin oil out there in the parking lot. Yeah. Looks like we don't care. This one is a full front from the body shop and then we have to apply ceramic coating on the full front because it originally had ceramic coating. Mm -hmm.
Got to get it back to the way it was. What up? over here I know there's soap and stuff sitting on the surface well, prep is everything um, most people can pretty much lay film but if you don't prep it you're gonna be in trouble um, you'll have contaminants on the surface such as oils and waxes um, you'll have dirt running out of the edges while you've got your film up there, it just will not be a very good end result. See guys, this is how detrimental it is to um, absolutely prep, 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 and prep. If you're spending money with us, we're gonna do our absolute utmost best to make sure that the final product is is the best that we can do. Um, we really kind of go the extra mile and get in the crevices and, and make sure the surface is chemically clean uh, before our pattern even touches the vehicle. Uh, we're also gonna do a lot of post uh, work to the vehicle. A lot of guys will just throw the film on it and send the car. We're gonna get the car completely done, get all the edges dry, we're gonna let it sit for 24 hours and look at it again and make sure that it is absolutely spot on. Gonna be okay with that? Another day in the life. What's cooking? What's popping? What What are all these beautiful gentlemen doing with all these beautiful vehicles? Tesla, CTSV, Tesla, GT3 Porsche. This is heaven. <laughs> what you got going on today? Not a whole lot. Uh, doing a date night tonight. So Anthony's gonna have to watch the kids and play video games with the mandatory. Uh, no, just getting through the day, working. That one you might have to blow out with air now because it's laying on the brake light. Too cold. Look how many towels I use when it's raining. Yep. Why are you so many towels? Huh? Tsunami and, uh, and tornado and stuff this afternoon. Mm -hmm. And really? hail. Really? Yeah. Uh, overall, it was really good. Uh, always something good to learn. Uh, a lot of awesome people to see. 
Uh, we got a national award for branding, uh, which is like uh, being a great ambassador and partnership and uh, making Expel look good and us doing a great job. So that was awesome. All of us got to go on stage and share that moment together. Uh, it was a really good time. Whew. Uh, we got a lot to learn, a lot of things to implement, uh, a lot of growth left in the, that we can get to. And the, the big dogs aren't as far away from us as I thought they were, which was actually awesome because even though we're far away from them, they're not as far from us as I thought, you know, and it's just the goal uh, that I think is reachable. It was good. I enjoyed it. Got to see a lot of familiar faces, talk shop with a bunch of different people. Um, I mean, it was, it was fun. It's always good. Now I'm just applying ceramic coating on top of the paint protection film for this vehicle, like I mentioned earlier. Mm -hmm. It was coated prior to its accident, so we gotta get it back the way that it was for the client. What are you using? Um, Expel Fusion. It's gonna be their four year coating. Uh, it's formulated to work with their paint protection film. That, uh, it's pH balance for this product. Mm. If you don't put the correct products on these materials, you, know, you run into issues with the material lasting it's the lifespan it should last. So it's real important that you use the correct products that work together with each other. Someone who's our me. So this one's a brand new G-Wagon right off the lot. It's gonna get, I think PPF, uh, but track pack PPF. We did his, this is the son, the dad. This is the dad, we did his son's that gray one from like two weeks ago. So he's gonna get a track pack PPF and full XRP plus um, window tint all the way around. So it's gonna have all the interior and the people inside of it protected from the harmful rays of the sun. Right. And they're gonna be hot in Texas. Yeah. What you thinking, Rod? I'm thinking what I need to cut in stealth and uh, gloss. Yeah. Mm. Pretty much nothing's gloss except this thing right here. So we're gonna do this one. We're gonna do this one, this one, this one, all the way across, and this one here all the way both uh, fender flares and rear and front. We gotta do this piece right here, which is called the A pillar, all the way around. Do the fenders, this piece. Mirror, grill, headlights, bumpers. Today. <laughs> It is? Cool. Oh. One, go. All right, we're gonna do another shop walkthrough. I got a really sweet Durango. It's the Hellcat version. It's got a partial Expel paint protection film on it. It's a, gonna have the full front bumper on the partial still, the headlights, and then it's got a partial hood, and it stops right here. I had to feel it because I could barely see it on this color. And then it goes down the fenders. And it's got the mirrors done. 
So that's a partial. If you want a full front that we do the most, it goes all the way up to here and up the fenders, fully wrapped and everything like that. And also got our best window tent, the XR Plus 98% infrared heat rejection film. Uh, let's go inside and see what's going on in the shop. We're back in the shop. I've got a Ford in here from a body shop. As you can see, they marked it up on some of the work they need to do. Looks like it got a new piece of glass. So we're doing one window over there on the driver's side. We got a Tesla. We did paint protection film on this one. Always a Tesla in here, always. We also did a full window tent, ceramic tent. Amazing. Look at that, no edges. This one, it's so hard to tell if they're tinted or not because there's no edges, it's so good. I literally don't know, but it's done. Spectacular right here. Porsche GT3, full body, Expo paint protection film, 10 year warranty. They're wrapping it up actually. And the G-Wagon, it's getting a full window tent, ceramic window tent, and a track pack paint protection foam package. This one's a little bit customized. Came straight from the dealer, full front. G-Wagon's a little bit more difficult than your average vehicle. You can see all these crazy curves and pieces. We're doing the front all the way up. These fender flares, mirrors, all the way around the roof here. So it doesn't get any chips. It's a big box. And we're gonna do the bottom rockers. It's a track back. and these as well and a piece back here that's what the track pack has that's the shop walkthrough i love this porsche i hope you guys can see it how i can see it hope the camera does it justice so as you know we just got back from the expel dealer conference in san antonio texas uh, we had a really good time and we got a award it's actually a national award for uh, automotive window tinting expel automotive window tinting as a brand ambassador um, and it was a really special moment to me um, because our whole team got to be there and we got to walk on stage and shake hands with the CEO the vice president uh, the national sales managers um, and we all got to do that together. We got a picture together. It was just a special moment um, It was an awesome event on the flip side Our guys were really excited to go and compete in the window tent competition paint protection And the home and business competition well on that side We know we had some things that didn't go our way. We did not win We didn't place and the guys were super bummed and you know, I wanted to talk to the guys about it because they're discouraged and down and uh, they feel like there's a lot of reasons that went against them that they didn't win. And you know, they were in the room with not like just people in Dallas, like there's hardly anybody there in Dallas to be honest with you. They're all from around the world and it's the best installers like us from around the world in every event uh, like I was talking about in every discipline like tent and uh, paint protection film and things like that so it's gonna be hard you're in the room with your peers with the best shops and best installers in the world and uh, it's not gonna be easy the the playing field has been leveled it's gonna you're gonna have to have just a good day a little bit of luck to, to beat the best of the best even if you're one of them it's just like in sports and so I wanted the guys to also know we didn't make it two years in a row we didn't win um, but neither did all the other shops even the ones that are bigger than ours they didn't win either um, you just gotta if you really want to be the best and you want to prove it you want to get on that stage and get an award and you want to take the number one spot you have to keep fighting you have to go every time figure out what happened talk to people um, you know ask the judges questions get to know them so you know a little bit more about what's expected and uh, you got to go back and keep fighting every year you're gonna learn more of uh, how they do things how things are ran because it is different than the way we do it in our shop 
and uh you know just like michael jordan there's a whole stat list of all the times he lost all the things all the times he missed the game winning shot but he's the greatest basketball player ever same with you know lebron james there's so many things he hasn't done right uh, that it way outweighs the times that they won and uh but they keep getting back up they keep going so if you want to be the best no matter what happens you got to find it inside of you to go back and compete again if you don't care it's not inside your heart and your soul to prove something you don't have to go back nobody's gonna judge you but for me um you know i like my guys to go i like them to try i like them to compete i'm not going to hold it against them if they don't want to go back but if they do i'll encourage them i want to be the best i get up again no matter how bad my day is um no matter how disappointed i am no matter what happens sick i can't walk we go and make these videos and uh we go to work and we do what we can to to get it done so you know Tritech here in Garland, Texas is one of the biggest shops in the country now. How do you think that happened? How many people did I go through? How many times did I get screwed? You know, and how many times did I get back up and go again? That's what it's going to take to be a champion. I want Tritech to be the biggest, you know, we're, we are the biggest company in DFW for Expel two years in a row. I want Tritech to be known as the biggest in the country and we got a few more people we need to get to and take down to get there so what do you do you keep going so any of you guys having a hard time you can quit it's totally fine i won't judge you the world may not judge you but nobody's gonna know your name either if you want you want to be the best you're gonna have to go back out there and get it so like subscribe ring the bell we'll see you next time